now we are here with the amazing Ron Fitzgerald. Hi, Ron. Hello. How are you doing this spectacular evening? Uh, we're great. We just had a great show here at the Chicago Film Festival. Uh, myself and the lovely Sin Cat. <laughs> That's. <laughs> we like it when she purrs. We want her purr for the camera. Yeah. <laughs> See, murder kitten. Oh yes, murder kitten, right there. Yes, she's very lovely. That's how she lures them in. And then, they're dead. They're just dead after that. Right? Lies, I'm perfectly innocent. Don't believe that. No. Never believe that. <laughs> so Ron, can you tell us how you got your start in the entertainment industry and um, what routes you've gone on since then? I started doing magic. I got a magic kit when I was eight. So that was my inroad into the uh, entertainment industry. My very first steps. And then I developed the show. And then later I developed it into, uh, you know, it, um, I wanted to make something that was more interesting and darker and more fun for me and something that nobody else was doing. Because I was, I was basically doing, you know, what I've been taught. It, 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 classic magic at first, which means birds, bunnies, tuxedos. And you can't even, you can't believe that now. Exactly. That's a, that's a reaction I get from everybody now is like, what? It's how it started. And then um, I, I went off the rails. <laughs> and uh, went to the dark side. And then it became the gothic illusion show that it is, you know. Well, it started in, 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 uh, a long time ago, it, it is today. And then once I developed this look for the show, then uh, film directors started coming to me and going, you have a great look, would you like to be in my horror film? And I said, yes. And that, that you know, then it, it goes from there. So then an actor, gothic illusionist, and, and also hosting uh, shows. Uh, I've hosted uh, different things and hosted some of these events. I have, in the past, I've hosted the Chicago Horror Film Festival. And, and also where, where we met at uh, Festival of Flesh, a burlesque show. So can you tell us about your production that you're currently doing right now, Dark Realm? Dark Realm. Yeah, it's a, it's a movie. You want to grab one? Grab one of those things. Show it right there in the camera. And it's not in 3D, but it can be for you right now, right there, <laughs> just like that. And Dark Realm is uh, an, it's a, a one-of-a-kind project. Nobody else has ever done a movie like this. It is, uh, it's like um, a large part of it is my live, shot in front of a live audience, gothic illusion show. A lot of the big illusions and some smaller things, but it's a big, you know, just wonderfully produced um, dark gothic illusion show. You get to see lots of it. And that is coupled with a horror narrative that runs around and through the uh, illusion show. And, uh, and so it's, it's, a, it's, it's gothic illusion performance and a horror narrative all made into this like gothic supernatural horror thriller and live performance. And it's really unusual. No one's ever done it that much. There's, there's been live performance in horror films before. Never this much. And never with a show that's been this, you know, there's, there, there's no other show like mine that, that's themed perfectly for a, a horror, you know, movie, because I, I, you know, that's part of the inspiration is, you know, horror and dark sci-fi and, you know, the supernatural and paranormal and, and, you know, weird dark things like that. That's the inspiration for the illusion show. So it fit in perfectly. So uh, a friend of mine, that my director, uh, Vincent Belanchio, he came in and said, let's shoot your show. And I said, let's not just shoot the show, let's make a movie out of it. And then it turned into this. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, you like it. You like it. We'll yes, sure you get to I definitely we'll enjoyed your you show. Duck, we'll duck take you to a chair. <laughs> force you to watch Dark Realm over and over and over again. So we saw earlier that you put razor blades in your mouth. What do razor blades taste like? Heavy metal? <laughs> Strangely enough, yes. Just a hint, you know, with a hint of blood, because you know they're you know they're real razor blades, and they do cut me, and I do bleed on stage, all for your entertainment pleasure. So where can we find more information about upcoming shows, where you're going to be next? Uh, yeah, darkrealmmovie.com uh, for the movie. And uh, fitzgeraldsrealm.com is where you can find. Uh, that's my website, and uh, there's a calendar on there and everything. And you can go in there. You can order merch. You can order the movie and uh, see the trailer on darkrealmmovie.com. You can see the trailer there. It's also on YouTube, and there's also bits of performance on YouTube. And the trailer for Dark Realm and everything else is up there. And uh, you can also find me on social media. You know, the, the evil and sometimes useless Facebook and uh, Twitter. <laughs> you know, the usual suspects, that kind of place. But, but I'm on there. And there's profiles, there's pages uh, for myself and for the Dark Realm movie. 
and, and for some of the other movies I've been in, uh, like Magus and things like that. Can you leave us with a favorite quote? Hmm. When I sees the land of the living, the other the realm of the dead, betwixt and between, I've always seen the dream that burns in my head. Okay, thank you so much.